What's going on guys? Etika from the Etika World Network here. I thought this article would be interesting because it does involve the Smash Ballad as every goddamn thing I've been talking about for the last three days. Well, but then again, I mean, it is a hot topic. I mean, the fact that any character can get in Smash Brothers, no one else could have asked for anything more from Daddy Sakurai. Either way, let's talk about this. Now, my Nintendo news, oh, before we get into that, shout out to Mighty Geno for showing me this. Will be in the description below, but Apparently, from my Nintendo news, we have confirmation of more than just one character being on the Smash Ballot. Let's go! Woo! But okay, let's look into this before, you know, let's, let's read the details before we let this get to our heads, because this is big news. Um, okay, there's five blank spots on the Super Smash Brothers character lineup. Nintendo could be, wait, wait, okay, is this speculation? Nintendo could well be considering a number of new characters in Smash Brothers. The official website has five blank spots on the character lineup, which presumably will be filled with five additional DLC characters, or so we hope. I don't see five spots. Oh, wait a minute. Okay, never mind. So if we move over... Wait, yeah, that's so weird. Let's zoom in a little bit here. So as you guys can see, you can go through all the characters basically by clicking the arrow buttons on the side. Um, I won't be able to fit this into the video and make it look comfortable, so I mean, yeah. Alright, so take a look at this, right? We start off with Mario, and we can just click the arrows all the way down until the last characters. And um, finally, at the end, we have Mewtwo. But, wait, where's Lucas? Is Lucas even in this lineup? I don't see any Luke. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, wait. They don't show Lucas because, um... Wait, that's, that's a little weird. I thought they didn't show us unlocked characters, or hidden characters, but they showed Lucina, who's a hidden character, but she's sort of not at the same time. I don't know, it's a little bit weird. You would think Lucas would be on this list, but um, Mewtwo's here, right? So now, if we don't see Lucas, I, I gotta confirm this one more time. Is Lucas not here? No Lucas. No Lucas. No Lucas. No Lucas. Okay, so he's not here on the list for some reason. It's a little bit strange, but... um. We do have five spots left on this list, and one of those presumably would be Lucas, so I guess it wouldn't be five spots necessarily, but I do see what my Nintendo News is talking about. Naturally, there's also a blank spot for the character that gets voted into the series by the fans, Banjo, Bayonetta, and King K. Rool. The list is endless, and you can vote for whichever character you'd like. So, well, this list doesn't really have any kind of influence from Nintendo officially citing that they have five characters coming in, but there's a lot of hope here because there's speculation to be gathered from the fact that there are five empty slots here. Is that just to fill in the website page so it doesn't look empty? I don't know. I would, I don't know. I mean, we could definitely be reading into this, but we have to remember that this is Super Smash Brothers and this is Daddy Sakurai. You can never predict what this guy is going to do. He, he lied directly to the fans just to keep certain things under wraps and they keep the surprise for later on. So, you know, it's, it's not so much of a bad thing as much as it's misleading, you know? So, is there hope for five DLC characters being available? Definitely is. He told us only Mewtwo is being worked on, and then Lucas comes from out of nowhere. So, it's it's definitely expected that there will be a lot more surprise to it. Daddy Sakurai always manages to fit something else in there, along with the initial surprise. And that's, what you, that, that's one of the things that's really appealing about this game. So, five extra slots. Well, those made for five DLC characters, quite possibly, but I guess that's up to interpretation by the individual. What do you think? Do you think I'm reading into this too much, or do you think there's actually something out of five slots being there, you know? Either way, I want to see your opinions in the comments below. I'll be responding to them as well myself. Let me know what you think, and I will talk to you in the next video. Take care of yourselves, and of course, as usual, please have yourself a damn good one.